Good afternoon, guys. Today I want to show you what I did. Uh, my latest obsession. I found a hobbies of mine that uh, I like to design floors, design house, and even decorate it. I didn't even know. Um, I found a software that is very intuitive and it's free. And also, it is um, you can just go to floorplanner.com and create your account and start making a house. So I want to show you what I like about this. But before we get for further, um, let's go ahead and click that like button and subscribe if you haven't already. And thank you so much. And let's get this video going. And so let's go ahead and uh, zoom this in. I want to show you the bathroom first. I have everything that I need. Uh, the size of this house is actually 454 square foot. It is 13 meters by 13 meters. So it's total of 454 square foot. If I go back to the 2D uh, view from the inside, actually, let's start from the inside. It's a six quarter on that side, and then this side, six quarter, not quite six and a half. That house is 454 square foot total. What I want, um, I want a little bit spacious kitchen. So you, you can see the kitchen is open space all the way to the living room. And it's a little bit bigger than any uh, room. I also uh, mixed up the bathroom and laundry since we have a very limited uh, square foot of the house I put this washer here and since I do not have um, storage I also put just kind of like a cabinet it's a very tall one and the bathroom is right here we have one sink here and um, then uh, a shower in the corner and tub so it's pretty much very functional a small house so let's go ahead and show you the 3d view of the house as you can see, I added a window, tinted glass, because, you know, that's where you sleep. You want a little bit, you know, uh, privacy. And what I added to this house, uh, this room, is, as you can see, this is actually an Asian fan. I love Asian fan. This is in the center on top of this uh, bed. Since we are working with very limited space, I put and added a... Um, kind of like a cabinet. Uh, I'd like to use this kind of like wardrobe, but this is not a, a wardrobe actually. You can use it in the kitchen, but I kind of like, like the idea that's putting in there. <laughs> so moving on to the kitchen, since I kind of like light black and red, so I kind of like randomly put some black and gray and red in the kitchen all over the house as you can see. So I do have a red refrigerator and red uh, coffee maker and stuff and red plate. Actually, I missed the other plate. I don't know what happened to it. I have six plate in here and glass and I stopped, you know, putting decoration. And this is the chandelier. I have a, a bar stool here, which is black and red. It's cute. It's a small kitchen. And um, I do have the TV here against the wall. I added all this nice, beautiful um, window and doors. And if I spin this around a little bit, as you can see, this is actually a circle window which is so cute and so and i added that kind of like a garden pathways and put a lot of planters there so there's so many design you can design your uh, you can design your house i actually added that beautiful couch there and uh, pillows and you know coffee table and stuff like that and i also added some fancy fence i think i just like this uh metal fence because it's a little bit fancy looking one so let's go ahead and show you an example how to actually remove and add any kinds of furniture around the house. How do you add walls and how do you add well, windows and uh, doors and stuff like that or kind of like you're shopping, putting all your any kind of uh, furniture, stuff like that. So let's go ahead and zoom this out so uh, you guys can see. Um, so if you'd like to have maybe let's just pretend we're gonna get a small table around here like a round table let's go ahead and do you see this chair this is where you go shopping and so just find round table see if we can find a round table a dark one because we have a very bright floor so we can see from you know from a sky view thing let's put that here and if you click that on the floor, you can see it's, we already got that. And let's go ahead and view that. 
what does that look like and then let's go ahead and zoom in see this is what we just put in and if you do not like because i think it's just too crowded already let's go ahead and remove that and by just clicking it it will pop this thing and it, there is a trash here just delete it all right so um i also want to show you how to like put in some window let's go ahead and view some of this window and remove and put it back so as you can see there we have door here we have windows and stuff like that so let's go ahead and like for example let's go ahead and do the the bathroom uh, you don't like the tinted glass window you want to replace that with uh, maybe square or something with design and you want it clear so you must be in 2d view and let's do that right here this is the tinted window let's click that one and click remove we are going to put some windows now this this is the one that i put in here so now let's go ahead and try maybe two glass window or you want one let's go ahead and let's go ahead and put this uh two windows here two glass window all you have to do just drag it and drop and if you like the the size of it just keep it that way but if you like it a little bit longer just click on it and then grab the blue at the very end and grab grab it wherever you like and if you want it longer like that and click anywhere to be done and then let's go ahead and view it in a 3d view see what we just did see what we did that is a very 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 clear glass also i want to show you not only how to uh, replace or remove window and any kind of structures uh you can also uh pick uh floors that you like so let's go ahead this one do not have any floors yet this is just the default uh let's go ahead i wanna if i wanna get my floors from kitchen to the living room since since this is an open concept um we can't really like put two different kind of floors because since it are one room the software only allows you to put one so on each room let's go ahead and put some floors here paint and let's go to the materials let's go to the wood i like the like lighter wood let's put this one so we have to do drag it and drop it by the kitchen all right now that's what your kitchen look like and if you like it that way leave it that way now i want to add the bathroom so let's go ahead and find tiles i like tiles in the bathroom i would like to i don't like very dark i just like like maybe this one is okay let's drop that one this is good enough let's go ahead and uh add some carpet in our bedroom so carpet and i just want it maybe let's go crazy about the colors hmm let's do lux or gold what do you think let's just drop anything oh i like blue let's let's drop blue blue carpet on the bedroom Ta da so now we have very beautiful colors so let's view this house in 3d come on come on so now we have a beautiful wood and then our bedroom or bathroom have a tiles nice there you go so um so anyways if you want to remove stuff all at once just click shift and highlight let's pretend we want to get these planters here and the fence shift and then highlight the fence that side there you go and then just kind of like grab it see but if, if you uh messed up if you want to put it back and then boom then you and oh no you you know you didn't put it right so don't worry see that one right there just click undo it will put it back isn't that easy so anyways thank you for watching um please support my channel by liking and subscribing if you haven't already if you have any questions please leave them down below and i will see you in my next video bye bye